come to hump day happy hour with the stepsisters. It's true. Isn't that sound official? Mm -hmm. I, like, I kind of like, like kind of like you know they. Maybe I should just do the. You know what? what? Next time we'll start with just like the scene, and mm -hmm. we won't be in it, and we'll be like you know like, oh, like, like an we'll announcer. Walk along. Yes, you know how they do it, like they do it on talk shows and everything. You know, welcome to the, everyone's clapping, clapping, yeah, clapping. Yeah. That's your guys' part. And they're like, welcome to Hump Day Happy Hour with the, the Sisters. Sisters. And then we'd like come out and do a little dance to our band. Yay. Oh, now we need a band. House band. House band. I think they're called a house band. We need a house band. Um, what else we're going to need? Stage, lighting. Some more cocktails. More cocktails. Hair, sure. makeup. No, yeah, we don't need definitely, that. definitely need that. For you. Yeah, exactly. Um, so, we started Hump Day Happy Hour at the beginning of COVID so that we Almost could... Almost a full year ago. Because if this is episode 55... Uh -huh. No, no, no. We did multiples for a while. We, gotta get we to had March to get March 15th. Miss... March 15th is when we went on... We... Well, it was yeah. a year ago? Yeah, about a year ago. Um, so, we're, we're close. We're getting there, people. Almost yeah. a year. Almost a year. And um, so, we start every episode with our masks on. Um, to remind everyone that we are still in a pandemic and it's really important to protect others and to protect thyself, um, yep. to wear the masks and continue social distance while we begin to get everyone vaccinated. That's true. And we're going to get there. We're going to be there sooner than you can believe in a blink of an eye now. Um, but that's what we're doing. So we start so. the show with our masks on because we're a mask on store and then we take them off so that we can actually talk to you. Our beverages without shouting. Um... Our delicious. Cheers to you. We're back to the uh, CVS. This is called the CVS. The um, cranberry vodka sour. Sour. Which could also be sunshine because there's lemon juice in it. Oh. Which is also makes it sour. It has a bit of a sting to it. Mm. It's delicious. Um, on ice. On ice. Yeah, on, on ice. ice. Um, so let's see. Since last week, has anything exciting happened, Sloan, in your life since last week? Nope, same old thing every day. It's dull, dull, dull. <laughs> we had some fun here last weekend. We did. We had, we had some, we had, it was very sunshiny here um, on Saturday, and we had a nice, we had a fun day. Kind of the perfect flow of people. Never too many, never too few. Everyone mm -hmm. was in good moods. Mm -hmm. We had one time where we got really close to our, our number. Remember that one time? Oh, our capacity. Yeah, our we're capacity. still capacity enforcers. We are. No one's There's room for everyone. Here. There's room for everyone. We're trying. We're doing our best. We're doing our best. Mm -hmm. um, so tonight's theme, because I'm going to make a little crinkling sound here because I'm going to open one of these. Tonight's theme is porch prep. Porch prep and deck decor. Deck decor. Did we actually put both of those on there? Oh, I'm so proud of us. So, you know, it's, I'm sure everyone was out on their porches and their decks this weekend already. Well, um, I put my furniture out. Yeah, everyone's got it out, right? Uh -huh. And you knocked off the dirt from last year and found the things that are brittle and had to go in the um, recycle bin. Yeah. Um, and you're thinking, okay, we're going to be outside a lot this spring and summer and fall so that we can be with people as different people get their vaccines at different times so we can include everyone. Um, and so, and it's also just wonderful to be outside. Well, and you still have to social distance even if you get your vaccine. Right, exactly, right. exactly. So we are gonna talk about some wonderful things and resources we have here at the store for you guys mm -hmm. that um, are good for outdoor, mm -hmm. entertaining, living, hanging out, mm -hmm. kicking back, relaxing, chillaxing, what else? Falling asleep. Falling asleep, what more napping. people do on their deck, napping, and their and their porch is fall asleep. A little bit of a little comfort area. Oh yeah, a little shady reading, mm -hmm. a little breezy, a little chill. Yeah, sorry about that, the crinkle. I like it a little. Would you just stop? I can't help oh, it. Oh my god, it's so fun. Oh my god, these are the easiest things so, to show. What are they? They're cups. So oh, these, see these? Know. They look like the blue solo cups. I love this color, but they're actually melamine insulated melamine. Oh, they're thermal. They're they thermal. The, they've got a wall. They're double walled. They're thermal. Oh, sorry. They're so cool. And they come in a set of four. Not breakable. Mm -hmm. Oh, I took the Would price like tag to? out. It's because it's on the back. 20 bucks for all four. Yep. Reusable. Like so good, you know, better for the environment because, and they're recyclable when you're done with them. Um, and they're BPA free, just so you guys know. These are all BPA free um, and all that good stuff. But not breakable. 
great way to serve drinks um, and um, be ready for socially social, socializing. This is your back here. Hey, your back here. Hey, you like uh, These are not on our online store, I do not believe. I don't believe that they are. They're only in store. Um, we have them in blue. We also do them in a blue gingham and a red gingham, which I think we've shown you many times before, but I'm not sure we've really shown you the solid blue, mm -hmm. which is very pop popular. Popular. Um, and they look kind of, I mean, it, you can kind of get the idea in here, but I think that this does the more justice one. I think showing them like this shows you how darling and cute they really are. They're cute. Oh. They're fantastic. If you, okay, first question of Pump Day Happy Hour, episode 55. First episode question. 55. Or as my, our grandmother would say, double nickel. Double nickel. Double nickel. If you had these awesome cups, what would you serve in them? or drink out of them if you had a little social distance porch get together. No, it's not, we're waiting for other people to answer first. You can answer us, you can answer later. While we're waiting for others, let's say hi. hi. Oh, let's say hi. We hi, have Chris. Laura, Stacy, and Kirk. Laura, Stacy, and Kirk. Oh, I have something for Kirk. Fabulous, everyone, hello. And Shirley and Michelle. Hi, Shirley, hi, Michelle. And Elle and Sherry and Marina. Elle and Sherry and Marina. This is and fantastic. Lillian. And Lillian. Okay, you know what? I just nice. realized I got on with you guys yet, so let me this do that real quick. This is fantastic. Okay, you know what? Wow. What you a guys party. What a double nickel party. Double nickel party. Episode 55. 55. Okay. So while, so on while we get some answers on what people may serve in these if they had them. If they had them. Inspiration cups. I have to go get something to show Kirk real quick. Okay. Just real quick. Okay. Just I'll be right back. This is. Will it be just for Kirk or will we all be able to watch? It's a cute story, but it's for Kirk. Okay, it's for Kirk, but, but it everyone... includes a cute story. But it includes a cute story, so we're all going to be in on the cute story that's just for Kirk. Whatever. Okay. Um, so people start typing in what you would put in these glasses if you had them, like what your cocktail would be. Or I had my hand raised and I was going to tell Casey what I'd put in mine, but she says I have to wait. Yes, we're going to let other people have first time. I'm not really crazy about time. waiting, but... Okay, Kirk. Kirk. Okay, first, let me give you a backstory. Three years ago, three years ago, my daughter was in eighth grade. Mm -hmm. She's a sophomore now, right? Uh -huh. So that's three years ago. Mm -hmm. Two years ago. Whatever. They had a, for eighth grade graduation, they have a bunch of events. Yes, they do. And they have a thing where it's like dads and breakfast. Dads and Wednesday. grads. Dads, or dads, dads, and gra something. dads and grads, that's what it is. And so was, my daughter's father's not involved in her life. And, um... Womp womp. Um, but so Sawyer needed a dad stand in, and Kirk, who joins us for the show often, is a very good friend of my sister's, and and by default because I'm her younger sister, and he comes here all the time, and he's awesome. He's my friendship. So he uh, was Sawyer's dad stand in. He was. He was and they real. walk. They walk from the school on Main Street, 41st of Main, and they go down to Winstead's, and they have breakfast together. Sadly, big my deal. daughter. Big deal, big deal. Big deal, big deal. My daughter ended up having some st tummy troubles and we had to like pull her out at the end. But Kirk had a wonderful time. Um, anyway, he had a wonderful time and it was a really good sport. Kirk has trouble making friends. Yeah. So, what was really funny is, you know, he does know, you know, these are just all strangers to him or whatever, but he ends up knowing, you know, after, you know, just making friends with everyone. Anyway, Kirk, the other day I was writing thank you notes and I pulled out a box of thank yous and I pulled this one out. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm very sorry, my dog oh. is kind of involved. Hey, Chance, come on, let's Chance, go we're here. not socializing right, right now. now. I'm telling a story about the and that dog's all the way across oh. the street. That dog is across the street, silly boy. Come on, office, please. So you pull office. out a box of thank yous. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Thank you very much. We sell these. Uh -huh. We sell these note cards. And I was using them, and I opened this one, and it already had a note written in it. And it says, Kirk, thank you so much for escorting me to the Winstead's breakfast. You made it so much fun, and I am very grateful. Hope to see you again soon, and thank you so much. Sincerely, Sawyer Simmons. Now, I believe you got a thank you note. I but, really do. Oh, I bet you didn't. No, I did, because no. this one has a scratch out. And I think she, she rewrote it because she had a scratch out. But I just want you to know that in case you didn't get the thank you, I have it, and I can still ma mail it. <laughs> Actually, we're going to step back from this for a minute. <laughs> The last thank you note that we sent you, Kirk, I understand you had an injury on your head from your mailbox while you were trying to open the mailbox with your head. We'll never know. So we're not going to be sending you any more thank you notes. We're only going to be giving them to you in on person. air. But I just, I just thought that was really on cute. On Facebook. I was like, oh, how cute. And I thought, 
God, I hope we mailed him a thank you note. No, you didn't. This is it. Uh, who knows? Anyway, there it is. But we Two years late, much. potentially. But anyway, we don't know. So, did anyone have any drink ideas that they would serve in these? Yeah, two gin and tonics, one Arnold Palmer. Ooh, what's a, called Arnold Palmer? Uh, I've heard of it. I just don't know what it is. You have to drink a golf ball. Uh, Kirk would drink straight grain alcohol. <laughs> And we have a root beer floats. <gasps> no kidding! I was root beer float. No shit, that's why I raised really? my hand. I would totally put a root beer float in here. Who did root beer float? Who was that this? was Laura. Oh, uh, awesome. here we go. Okay, you know what that just made me realize? These would be wonderful as dessert cups. Like because strawberry shortcake layers. Right. And keep up these. Stay cold. We refrigerate, idea. we refrigerate our melamine plates at home when we're going mm -hmm. to serve ice cream cake because the, cake, the plate is already cool. Brilliant. I know, genius. Cannot. Brilliant. Okay, so these are a wonderful pork prep and deck decor. Four for what, 10? Four for 20. Four 20, that's right. Um, but they, they last forever. Oh, uh, yeah. So you don't have to keep buying these over and over again and filling up the damn landfill. No, I so, don't. We, we, also, these. we also have a couple more hellos. Hi. We have Candy, Barbara, and Marla. Hi, Candy. Hi, Barbara. Hi, Hi Marla. And also Carol and Deanna. Hi, Carol and Deanna. And Suzanne. Hi, Suzanne. Hi, Suzanne. How um, exciting. Oh, and Paige and Juliet. Hi, Paige. Hi, Juliet. And Arnold Palmer is a lemonade iced tea, and we have a sangria. I think I've oh. had a lemonade iced tea without liquor in it. Ever. Are there liquors in all Arnold Palmer's? I don't know. I would think so. Okay, now I have a secondary question. Does that include, is that like a long run iced tea with lemonade? Or is that like iced tea, no, and, iced lemonade? tea and lemonade? Is that your polite way of asking if Arnold Palmer is a virgin? <laughs> yes, that yes. is our polite way. That is our polite way. Is our Arnold Palmer a virgin? I can answer that. Okay. Not that so, I have personal knowledge, but no. Nice porch prep. Mm -hmm. Cups. Now, you guys know we do the melamine plates and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we talked last week about all the Easter collections and the new polka dots mm -hmm. and all that. And we still have a few that because we carry them all the time. And there's a bunch of new ones coming in and restocks of our most popular design. Pop! You are! Because Casey's popular. Yeah. Um, yeah, anyway. go like that. And we delivered a thank you from two years ago. So we're, we're on a roll already, right? Well, you feel like... Boy, Abby, look at it. We're running ahead of time again. You've sent that thank you from two years ago. What if we can pull up from three years ago? You, you never know. You know, I'll keep going through thank you boxes in my house and see if there's any more that haven't hey, been sent. That's hilarious. Wasn't that hilarious? I just... Anyway. You try to raise your children right. Send a I'm, thank you I'm note. just hoping beyond all hope that no. um, it actually went out. So. No. Anyway, okay. So now a couple other things. For porch prep. That are porch prep. And deck decor. And deck decor. Mm -hmm. First of all, you guys know about, I just had to put this up here because of the dog. <coughs> this is the reserve for the dog. We also have the reserve for the cat version. The dog one's online. The cat one is not yet. I swear, I swear I'm going to get it done. I'll get it done tomorrow. I'll just do it. I forgot this week. Why I just forgot. Wait a minute. Let me hold my breath. Oh, I forgot. I just forgot. Anyway, these are $40. These are not indoor, outdoor pillows by design, but there's no reason they couldn't go on a dry porch. Yeah, a porch that doesn't get wet. Right. Which I also think would be really cute. In a chair by the, if some people put those cute chairs by the front door where they sit outside mm -hmm. this would be really cute mm -hmm. so they know that you're dog people but talk about the pillow that okay. is indoor outdoor i put this up here because this was the inspiration pillow this pillow is made with indoor outdoor fabric and an indoor outdoor which, material with an indoor outdoor ma uh, material what that means it is oh i'm sorry i have to talk louder what that means what that means is it is stain resistant fade resistant and moisture resistant it is not proof First of all, the sun takes everything eventually, right? Bleaches it out eventually. She's pretty big. Um, so you can put these out and not worry about them unless they get like sitting in heavy water or something. And they do have a washable. They're soft. Put your head. This has a hidden soft. zipper, so you can wash this. Okay. And, and you the take it interior. Apart to dry. Yes, the interior has a moisture resistant bag. And this is a moisture resistant coated bag and the um, foam particles are moisture resistant and therefore mildew resistant and all that. Okay. So they're not going to get all stinky and nasty. But it's soft. But it actually still feels like an indoor pillow. That's why we call them indoor outdoors because you could use this inside. It doesn't have that slick feel. It's that great. Kind of has the sunbrella feel. Yeah, but, but it's a soft. little softer. Like you could put your head on it and it's not going to be itchy. Let's just try. Put it. Oh, that's nice. 
While Casey's very, asleep, Mom. Very, very nice. Let's say hi to Melissa and Edward and Janie and Dawn. I hi, have Melissa. a little hi, bit of the nappy lips. Hi, Janie. Hi, Dawn. Hi, everybody. Okay, I have nappy lips. Would you okay, please sorry. get up off the pillow? Oh, that's really nice. Just it's a nice pillow. That's called How much power is that nap. pillow? This pillow is 80, includes the insert. Yep. So this is the one we have, but we can get multiple. But look how both sides pillow. are a little different. Oh, I'm sorry. Ready? One side. Two sides. So the pattern, the fabric repeats, but you'll kind of get whatever mix you get. And if you need multiples, we can get those. We just have one so far, but um, we can get you as many as you want. So if you want a match set or a set of four, we can do that for you. Isn't that darling? Mm -hmm. I kind of feel like we should it have a dog. Up, it ended up really, 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 really cute. Really cute. Can we just put this there or over or something? Oh, we can put it down here for now. Let's move it over. Okay, move it over there. She's moving over there. I have an assistant now, handling this, this right now. This is not on the online store. And the these cups are not on the online store, so if you guys want them um, and you want to purchase them, you can comment and we can hold them for you. Mm -hmm. So this this is anything not on, online, we can hold and we don't have to worry about it selling out at the same time. So cups and pillows. Here, I'll just put these here. Cups and pillows. Except okay, so someone gets thirsty like me. So thirsty, are you? Just so thirsty? <sighs> so thirsty. So thirsty. Thirsty, okay. thirsty, thirsty. Very thirsty. Should we talk about these I was quite thirsty. That's why mine's rugs. almost gone. Yeah, these are incredible rugs. You, yeah, you should talk about them. I should. Indoor, Is outdoor. this all the colors that come in? This particular one, but I have more to okay. explain. Okay. Indoor, outdoor. Mm -hmm. Stain resistant, fade resistant, moisture resistant rugs. This, you can actually put poolside, lakeside. Um, on the dock. Dock side, and if you happen to have the, the wonderfulness of having a beachfront home somewhere, you can do it there. Cabin, this would be very, very good. Little cabin this is in the woods, little man by the window stood, saw a rabbit hopping by, Wait. knocking at his door. Help me, help me, help me cry. I don't remember the rest of the song. I'm sure you do. No, a little Come cabin on. in the woods. I don't. I was just singing the little cabin part because you said if, if you had a cabin in the woods. Ah, okay. All right. Good to know. Um, this is made from a product called PET. Um, PET is made from recycled, basically recycled plastics, recycled it's water bottles hand most woven. specifically. This rug is hand woven. And what they do is they take those recycled plastics and they spin them into yarn, much like a wool. And they do indoor outdoor yarns a bunch of different ways. Like this, right? And like this, we're gonna show you this in a minute. This is another, this is called polypropylene. This is the outdoor thing you, you're used to seeing. It's real slick, has that outdoor feel, okay? These look like, feel like, and act like wool. So they're soft, okay? They also sometimes act like cotton. Yeah. You know where wool is itchy? This is not itchy. This There's is almost nothing like itchy about this or, or slick about this. This feels like a nice soft rug. What they do is they create yarn and then they braid the yarn into rope. So you can see this is a piece of braided rope. Can you guys kind of see that? Let me see if I can find something to push through that hole. So this is actually like a piece of rope. Does that make sense? No. Dakota, does that compute? Mm -hmm. Okay. Then they take the rope and they make a rope woven rug. Mm -hmm. hand what? Up. Hand people, hand oh, people, hands hands do this. Uh, uh, I miss you so much, right? Humans make this rug. Humans hand make woven rug. They have a wonderful bound finish like this. This is how your binding will look when it comes. Okay, these are the samples, so they have a little bit different. They look like this. They have a nice finished binding, and this is how the back looks, right? Beautifully made. Um, and in this particular exact rope woven design, comes in three colorways right now. Okay, this beautiful ivory, natural, natural, and I think it's called and denim. denim. Yeah, denim. the denim has the heathered rope. So these. Are here, right? Here's so other. We're gonna need a drum roll. Ready for it? Wait for it. Washable. Yep. What that means is you're not gonna put this in your washing machine because this will be fine. But no, your washing because machine it will break. says for cleaning, gently brush with soapy water and spray with a water hose. Water hose. So it means a water hose. So you can take this rug, no matter where you're using it, take it outside. Put it on a little bit of an incline in your spilled, driveway. What if you spilled cranberry juice on it? Uh, no problem. What if you crushed barbecue sauce into it with your foot? No problem. No problem. These 
can even be treated with bleach and not change. Um, we suggest using color safe bleach first mm -hmm. um, and especially environmentally friendly soaps when you're washing them because you're going to be outside doing this. Okay, if you need to do it in your tub, if you have a condo or something, you can do it down in your tub with your shower sprayer. Okay, you take this out, put it on an incline, and literally, I mean, high pass, spray it out, clean it all out, rinse, 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 so rinse true. while you water the plants and, and give the birdies a little bit of water, water, and then you let it get bone dry, and voila, you have a clean rug. So, if you like ivory colored rugs, which a lot of people do, they are a great, fantastic look in a lot of homes. This is a great rug to use inside, and you get that fabulous light color ivory, but you have the wearability of an indoor outdoor rug. So you don't have stains, walk things, and all that. Okay? People with young children and dogs love this rug. These are amazing. So these rugs come in one, two, three, four, four five, six. five, six, seven different sizes. So as small as the one you see on this countertop, which is a two foot by three foot. And as big as a 10 by 14. Porch, deck, big family room, um, kitchen, shared area, uh, three season porch, bedroom. We don't care where it's you It's like you're an architect. I can't even keep up with you. Um, so I do not recommend this particular rug for stair runners. We do stair runners here. I don't re recommend these rugs because they do this when they make, see it, what they do when you bend them, they make a row like that. And besides you could catch a heel on it. Yeah, it's just too, I don't think it's very attractive as a stair yeah. runner because it kind of opens the loops. Okay, questions anyone? Rug 101, completed. No, but say hi to Peggy and Jim. Hi Peggy, hi Jim. And also Ivy and Jody. Hi Ivy, hi Jody. So, we should ask everybody, um, first of all, welcome to Hump Day Happy Hour. Um, Woohoo! Episode 55, the double nickel. 55. 55. You can't drive 55. No, 65. I actually can't drive either one of those speed limits. Um, completely unable to. Weird. Um, and everybody let us know. We are having what is called the CBS, named by us, because all of the contents of this were purchased at the CBS. Cranberry vodka. Spritzer. Nah. What's it called? Sour. Sour. It's got lemon in it. Because it makes your face do this when you drink it. It's delicious. We love it. It has a kick. Cranberry juice. And that now, once again, we'd love to ask what everybody else is, is consuming tonight. Water, beer, tea, coffee. Let us know what you're having because we like to know. And do we have a question, Dakota? Yes, I think Casey's looking at it. Yes. Casey, what is the question? Yes. Okay. Uh, Candy's question is, are these the same rugs by the company that she normally sees in our store? Just yes. so you guys know, rarely, very rarely, do we ever have like a fun, playful rug by anyone else. The I only rugs it's, in our it's store... Been, like, over Years. Right. The only rugs in our store are all made by the same designer. Her name is Annie Selke, and she has these little divisions of her design company. One of them is called Dash and Albert, and Dash and Albert Rug Company, okay, is what these are. We have been selling rugs by this maker and designer for over 15 years. Mm -hmm. We absolutely love the line, always have, and as it evolves, it has continued to evolve to be a really great fit continuing to be a really great fit for our store, and we're a great fit as a, as a store that represents them. Um, we met Annie many times. We, are, we have a good relationship with this company, um, woman-owned, tons of women in, in management and at the upper levels and throughout the whole company. Um, good human beings, nice people, fantastic product. And Annie herself, another interesting tidbit, Annie herself, I just untied my shoe. Hope it'll trip. Um, Annie herself was one of the rug maker designers who helped establish um, the early organizations that police the globe so there's no child labor, no unfair uh, labor practices, fair trade, and all that stuff for the rug industry. And um, so just in every way they match up with our mission, our ethics, our philosophy, and, and the rugs they sell and the quality, but the price point is incredible. For the rugs you get, and the quality you get and the lifespan of these rugs you get, I can guarantee you these are very well-priced rugs. That doesn't mean they're cheap. It doesn't mean that they are, um, that you sometimes won't be like, that's, you know, I have to spend $1,000 to get a big rug or a bigger rug. It just means that you get a lot of value, a lot of bang for your buck. They so thank you for asking that, that Candy. Um, they last, these are meant to last. Actually, it's really bad for business because <laughs> we still don't have to replace 
we seldom have, in 15 years, we've had very few people like, I'm ready for a new living room rug. We're like, well, and just to, just to put Dakota on the spot, this is just three samples of an entire wall we're standing next to. Him. Yeah, and he could do, I mean, he could just do a little drone on it. There's more than, well, there's more than one rug. There's hundreds of rugs. Hundreds. Hundreds. Lots of rugs, and they all come in five to seven, sometimes more sizes. So these guys are the, are the deck and porch ones she's showing tonight, which are so soft. So I just picked one, you can't hear us uh, when they're that far away. Okay, so I picked, we have many categories of rugs, indoor, outdoor, cotton, wool, blah, blah, but I only picked one, one rug in three colors tonight, so far as all we've shown you, and there's hundreds. So we don't, we only do like little features on these Look at how shows. good this blue one looks with that pillow because it's got that little bit let's of look at the gray wash. Let's washing. look at the dog pillow with all the colors. No, seriously. Should we have a boat? Yeah, here we go. If you were buying the pillow and a rug to go with it, would you pick white, ivory, or natural, natural. or denim? Oh, now, I'm more the fact that there's a chair involved. My probably. decision's made. Okay. Let's vote. Uh, denim, ivory, natural. Let's see how the vote comes out. I am going to make my vote private. We already know your answer. Okay. By the way, we knew your answer before you even said anything. Would you ever vote against a color blue? No, I would never. Right, vote exactly. So I don't even know how. Oh, look, there's an endorsement here by Kirk Eisenhower for. And he says he can't say enough good things about Dutch Velvet rugs. Oh, um, Posing them down in the yard is the real deal. Um, can be all dingy at, at just with a hose and some soapy water. They look like new. They do look like Thank you uh, for that endorsement. Kirk would pick denim. Candy would pick ivory. Dawn would pick ivory. See? Jenny Foltz just joined us. Hi. Hey, we're Jenny voting Foltz. on a rug color. If you were... If you had the dog pillow, would you do If you had the dog natural? pillow and you were going to coordinate it with your rug, which color rug, ivory, denim, natural, would you... They all three look fantastic. I, I there's no wrong answer. Well, there's one that's a, that's my answer. There's a there's Sloan's answer and then no wrong answer. That's right. Sloan's answer and no wrong answers. Right, and no wrong answers. Okay. That's so, true. That's true. Okay. And hi, friends. Hi, everybody who's joining us for episode 55 of the Hump Day Happy Hour with the Stop Sisters. Barbara says denim with a close second of ivory. Mm -hmm. Juliet says ivory. Mm -hmm. uh, Marla says denim. So here's the interesting thing is no one is saying natural, which is funny because the natural is the, I think, no in the other pattern it's the right. number one color. Right. This ivory is, has become very popular because it's just so rare you can find a rug in this color you can watch. <laughs> oh, they want God. pricing. Let's talk about pricing then. Okay. You guys ask, I will answer. So I'm going to the screen. The little two, the two by three is on the pillow. On the pillow. Oh, on the pillow. $80. $80. Pretty sure it's $80. And yeah. the, the I'm gonna give you a price range on the rugs. I know it starts around 160 for the two by three. Yeah, the pillow's one. One is is eighty dollars, and it's called woof 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 woof. Do I sound like a little dog or a big dog? Little Medium. Dog? Medium. Mm -hmm. This rug. Dang it. Starts in a two by three for 162, and gets as the 10 by 14 is 3,620. That's right. So the prices are like 162, and then it jumps to like 396, 524, and so on. Um, these are great um, doorway entry rugs, inside or out. You yeah, can catch the stuff. Catch the stuff. Because it's got those, it's great. You can wipe your feet off this and it won't hurt it a bit. You can just wash that stuff. I'm going to walk these Okay, over was that fun? Here. Did you guys like that? I'm Everyone walking these over here. Ah! Ah! Sloan? What? I'm going to have to ask you to stop barking. No. Help. No. Help. Help. I love these rugs. Okay, now we're so be fun. Because Rest this show so is yo. porch prep and deck decor. So that's the theme tonight, tonight, so we're going to stick with our theme a little bit here for at least a little while. We're going to pretend I have a focus. It kind of goes off the rails here sometimes. You never know, right? Well, because Casey drinks. Uh -huh. My sister pours. Things get a little bit difficult because Casey drinks. Yes. So, 
Slum. Mm -hmm. We talked about PET. Now mm -hmm. this is polypropylene. Would Correct. you like to talk about poly polypropylene? Or would you like me to? I'm not really feeling it. You better talk. No, <laughs> polypropylene. So we have a lot of customers in the Brookside area and other places that maybe live in older homes. These rugs are terribly popular because they've got a thinner, you know, a thinner height to them, so they're better for lower threshold doors and things like that. This is not nearly as thick as the other rug. It also is not as soft. There's lots of good to this. This is a great rug for porches and decks because it stays very smooth. Um, cleans exactly the same with water hose and soapy water. Um, you can spill on it and you can hose it off. It dries very fast in the sunshine. They look good on both sides. And it looks like sunshine. It looks like sunshine. This one, I can't remember the name of it. This is a two by three. She's bright rolled stripe. out. I think it's bright stripe or something like mm -hmm. that. Here's the other thing is, so PET, polypropylene. You guys are learning a lot today, aren't you? PET is the one that feels like, has fibers to it, feels like wool. So that means it's hard to groom it. You can vacuum it or shake it out, you know, snap it and all that, no problem. This you but you can't really broom it because it has all those fibers and the little leaves and all that. So if you're going to true outdoor, outdoor, and you want to be able to broom it or blower it off, you know, obviously the blow under it's going with it. This is the rug. This is the rug. These are groomable. Mm -hmm. So you can sweep on these rugs. And of course, in case you're wondering if we have pillows for this color palette, we do. These are brand new. They're indoor, outdoor. They're indoor, outdoor. So that means, so what does that mean? They can go indoor or outdoor. No, that wasn't the answer she was looking for. They are indoor and outdoor. They're for the indoors and outdoors. Stain resistant, fade resistant, moisture resistant, and washable. So they're good for indoors or outdoors, right? She's been training on this for 15 oh, years, Oh, for God's people. sake, I knew it was 15 nice. years. 15 years. Do you know what I love about this pillow? What do you love this about side, this pillow? On this side, it's an orange dot with a white resist. And on this side, it's a white dot with an orange resist. I love these pillows. Indoor, outdoor, hidden zipper. Again, hidden zipper, as Casey mentioned on the last pillow. It also, sorry, I just zipped this in. Also has the covering. That's moisture resistant. Yes, Casey's absolutely right. These are good for indoor outdoor. This has a very soft cushion. Let's do it. it. Let's do the let's do the test. Ready, Sloan? Taking my nap. Ready? Oh, that's I good. love them. They're soft. That's very very nice. This one I believe is called well orange. This one is called cobalt. Cobalt does the same thing. It does. Two I sides. am taking a nap. You did that a minute ago. Could you please wake me in thirty? Get up. Yes, ma'am. So Woo, on headed. this side, white with a blue resist. Blue with a white resist. Now, I love these. These colors. come in actually four colors. Mm -hmm. They come in blue, orange. They come in a mint. These guys are eighty-eight. Yeah, they come in a mint, green, turquoisey, wonderful thing. Mm -hmm. And then yellow. Gosh, I already forgot. Let's look it up in the floor book. Oh my gosh, a floor book. We don't even what keep it on called? the floor. Oh my gosh. Oh my darling. Oh my darling. On the spot. There you go. Five colors. I was wrong. Five color palette right here. Okay. Navy, orange, citrus, sky, and gray. They also do lumbar in them. Okay. And they have the smaller dots on the lumbar. And they will be this the reverse again. Mm -hmm. side okay. To side. See that wonderful color palette? How fun for outdoors is that? Yeah, we've seen this one, and it is as pale as it looks. I mean, it's, it's a, a very, pale pillow. Very pale. These are very pale, and they're wonderful. Yeah, they're lovely. They're gorgeous. Yeah. Brand new, brand new. This has been around a while. These rugs, let's just do this again since I did it for the other one. These rugs have a different price point. They're a lower price point because they have um, less materials in them because they're not as thick, and a little less work because they're not making string, they're not making thread and rope and weaving them. Uh, Dakota, I think there's a question. We have a question. We have some hellos, actually. Oh, hi, everybody. We have Michelle, Jackie, and Brenda. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Jackie. Hi, Brenda. And then also Pat and Maria. Hi, Pat. Hi, Maria. Everybody, what a day. What a Wednesday. What, what a wonderful day. Happy Wednesday. 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 Bright stripe. Is that the right one? Mm -hmm. No. Yeah. Yeah. It's on the tag. The name's on the tag. I usually write them on the tag. What does it say? It's on your end. No, it's on the price. It's on the. Boy, I remember my first day. 
This one is called Tropical Stripe. Tropical Stripe. Bright Stripe looks like this. It's slightly different. I'll show you guys because I got confused. That's Bright Stripe. It's got a little bit different color palette. Isn't that pretty? I love that. It's Tropical Stripe. This is the one really so, good. So, like a tropical drink for on your porch in one of our melamine cups. cups with a little bit of garnish, maybe some pineapple wedge sticking out of there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um, it's perfect. Sun, mm -hmm. don't drink and then type. Tropical Stripe also comes in a pillow, and I'm going to really tease you in a minute. Starts at 58 for a 2x3, mm -hmm. and goes as much, it only goes to a 9x12 instead of a 10x14. By the way, a 10x14 is a massive rug. That's actually the size of my living room. Yeah, 990 is the 10x14. So the price point is about half of the other rug. So again, we have rugs in all price points also. And I want to show you something fun. I'm going to pull out the book again because this is really because fun. Because she likes the book. She likes a lot. Now, she, she what like, you're also seeing She loves tonight, a good library. I just like information because I am an information junkie. I'm insatiably curious about everything. The, um... This is the floor book that we don't keep on the floor. This is the... It's, oh, you want to keep it on the shelf? I keep it on the shelf. Do you want to put it it's on the floor? Book. Um... So what you're experiencing tonight is a little bit of what it would be like if you made an appointment on a Wednesday for a rug appointment. You would get all of this about any rug here. You would get our undivided one of our undivided attention. I go for Casey. You would get all the information we have plus more. Mm -hmm. We can help you do measurements. We can help do color palleting, everything. No charge for in-store consultation. You can bring pictures of your project and we will help. We've been doing this quite a while and I like to think we have pretty Darn good. Oh, it's tropical stripe. I tried to look up the wrong one again. Taste. Casey has trouble with the alphabet, everybody. Casey drinks when she comes to work on Tuesdays, and so it's a little... So I've been drinking all day. No. God, you, if I've been drinking all day, I would not be standing here. Okay. So, three... While she looks it up, I have to show everybody something very 35. exciting. Okay, New to the website today. These, this rug made me think of them. These are hand-blown. Glass Hearts by our dear friend Carrie. Hand worked, hand blown, hand worked. Lovely hot glass. These are $69. They are on our online store. They remind me so, watch this slide. Boop. Look how they look on this rug. Each side is different. So, I just had to show these because they're on the online store today and they're very exciting. You have all the colors, look. Orange, red, yellow, green, blue. It's like Roy G. Biv. Look at that. I love perfect. it. They're absolutely perfect. Rainbow Coalition, baby. So while we're and in the rainbow. $69. 69 okay. Mm -hmm. And they were in an email today. So yeah. the link is in your email in your inbox. Yeah. Just so you guys know. And on we the put out an email today that was new, restocked, just arrived, and unexpected finds. That's right. Was the theme. That's right. This fabric this rug comes in a pillow version that pillow doesn't feel like this one it feels a little more rug like it's rough and this is a poof a big square poof like this a big cube like this so these so tropical stripe comes in other accessories other home decor items here's the pillow with some of the other pillows indoor outdoor pillows we sell isn't that cool in a pillow i love that you can see the center mark better. So my point is, you see this book? Check it out. This is like the everything Bible. Idea Central. Idea Central. I mean, look at like how many rugs just on that one page. But we have samples in this store for every rug that they make. An actual sample that you can touch, feel, and check out at no charge. Um, you can take it home, try it, the sample in your home, see if it works. That way you can see texture, color, um, height for door clearance and things like that. All Pretty true. Awesome, isn't it? All true. I'm just looking at these hearts. Those, those are really pretty. Could it, let's put them on white and see. Hey, could it? We had them on the white pillow. Oh, you did? Yeah. I, was, I was looking something up. Yeah. We did them let's on the white these dot. Again, again new to so the online store. Pretty. So pretty. So fantastic. So fantastic. So, did we get reports from anybody on what cocktails they're consuming? This evening, or what's in their glasses? That's always fun to know. Let me see. The Arnold Palmer was for these guys. Oh, 
Susanna Room Monitor put the link to the glass hearts. Aww. There's only two right now, so seriously, those are the two. So if you'd like them, jump online and please buy them. Um, we have another on the original question. Yep. Uh, we had another blue with an ivory second. Yeah. Um, you told Dawn the price on the dog pillow because she missed it the first time, right? That's okay. We got that one. Yeah, we got that one. Okay. I don't see any drink. Dawn's drinking gin. Gin. That's Sloan's, that's Sloan's liquor of choice normally. Um, <laughs> Kirk, I just saw that. We hadn't pimped one product so far right at the top of the show. Let's get busy, ladies. I love you for keeping us on task. Love you, love you. But here's as what I'm going to say. Pimped it all out. We're selling stuff that's not even here that you can order. That's how, how good we're doing tonight. That's right. Um, Ten Grand Tonic. Yeah. Um... What's this? Always a good idea. Just a Rono? I don't know what that is. Does anyone know what that is? De Serono? It's an amaretto. Yeah. It's amaretto? Yeah. You looked that up. Yeah, right I here. I thought you knew that. I was like, whoa. No, the crew doesn't drink alcohol. I know, that's why I was impressed. I was like, uh, he knows all his alcohol, he doesn't drink? That's very interesting. Very interesting. Hood is a man about town. He's a man about town. So we did the first one. So now here's the question on the stripe rug. If you had to pick only one pillow, which you don't, you could pick them all, which A pillow would you put with this rug for your home? Sloan, we already know your answer. We already know your answer. Oh. <laughs> Does anyone else oh. have, like, to go with your decor, your porch prep or deck decor, or wherever in your home you would like these items, mm -hmm. which would you choose? I'm just curious. Um, Sloan. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have a citron vodka, olive, and ice. Ooh. Ooh. Nice. You like the olive part. That like yeah. lights your fire. I'm a dirty martini girl myself. I like a Kettle One Dirty Martini Extra Dirty. That is, to me, a dream cocktail, sitting at a bar, having a nice time. Sloan, wave to the gentleman window shopping. Yes. Not too much. He'll get, he'll get upset. You don't okay, we have two oranges already. Two orange pillows. Is that a good view for them? Yeah, I, really, I took them down so we didn't have to shout over them. Oh, okay. So, okay, orange or blue? I, I can vote. I'll vote. Sloan? Okay. We already know your vote. I guess we're good. Hey, who thinks Sloan, okay, who thinks Sloan is going to say blue? If you think Sloan's going to vote blue, just hit the thumbs up emoji at this time. I'm just saying, if you think, oh, I lost the show. If you think that that's what Sloan would say, uh oh, we have two, we have three oranges and two blues. Oh, come on! I'm gonna go ahead and say that I believe Sloan hit the blue. See? Go blue, go blue! Come on, blue! Pull ahead, pull ahead! Come on, on the voting, go blue! Go okay, blue. here's what we're gonna do. If you think, go if blue. you prefer the blue pillow, you're gonna, we're gonna do this again. Everyone stop. Okay, now. Go blue! If you want the blue pillow, you're gonna hit the. Oh, come on! Thumbs up emoji. If you think the orange pillow, hit the heart. Ready? No. Unfair. I'm voting, I'm voting, I'm voting, because I really Unfair. like the orange in this case. Everyone vote. Red for orange, blue for blue. Sloan, this has been... Casey, it's, it's you're neck and fixing neck. the election. It's neck and neck. No, you're fixing. You're, 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 you're <gasps> playing dirty. The blues are winning big time. Hell yeah, they're winning. Look go team! Look at that. Go team, go team, go team! We like blue. Yes, we do. I love blue. We also like saying hi to oh, Rochelle, Ellen, orange. and Patty. of a lot of curiosity this evening. Who wow. thinks we should start this evening is occasionally the iceberg. <laughs> when I say insatiably cur uh, curious, I mean insatiably curious. Yes, and who thinks who thinks we should start doing um, like giveaways during the show? I do. Okay. Do does I anyone can? does anyone else agree? Does anyone have a vote? That if you think we should do that? Give us a um, what, not the emoji, but in comments. Smiley. Let's see what should we put in comments? Yes, just a smiley face, or the word yes, yeah. or um, something like that, so we can see how many people would participate 
It would be a live giveaway. I have an idea. It, you'd have to be on the show. It would be given away while you're on the show, just so you know. So people who watch it later, not to be eligible to win, just people who get on. This is for our Hump Day Happy Hour heroes. Kind of sad. Who are regulars. Just kind of sad because there are people who come and have to watch it later. Yeah, but we do stuff for people all the time. We do we free do. gifts and giveaways and That's raffles. True. I'm saying just heck yes. We got a heck yes. Anyone else? Oh, we got a yes. Heck to the yeah. Well, who's going to oh, say Oh, hell no? yes. I don't know. Some people may be like, not my thing. Yeah. You know, I don't need to give. I just like to watch you guys be idiots. <laughs> we got a, we got a, no, uh, only actually, face. only, only one of us is actually. Giveaways. Idiot. What? Of course. Such a smiley face. I so love the polite. personalities of you guys. You guys are so wonderful. Okay. I'm going to work on it for next week. I'm going to have a plan. Oh, yeah. Suzanne says, oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, to the yeah. Oh, to the yeah. We're going to put this here. Give me, give me I think they kind of tied, guys. I really, they were, yeah. blue barely won, but the orange really had a lot of votes. This is going to tell you, because I don't want to lose these. I, guess I, don't, I won't lose them. I it's a very vibrant are. rug. Um, very vibrant. We did not talk mm -hmm. about our other kinds of rugs tonight. Um, that could be like another time. Don't you think? I mean, there's a lot of Absolutely. Kinds of you know that I love everything that you guys select for the store. <laughs> Barbara, that's very well, thank sweet. You. That's very kind. Very sweet. Um, that is actually very nice. We actually did some selecting today. Mm -hmm, we did. Mm -hmm. We already have stuff rolling in almost every day, and now we have even more rolling in behind it because we have been busy, 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 busy little selectors. Mm -hmm. It's very um, different during COVID. It's kind of our job. We are having to do a lot of Zoom and online and picture looking and going through things and having people send us images and all that and it's it's much different than we're used to i don't like it nearly as much no but we but we have made it happen yeah we've seen artists already deliver this week yeah all kinds of fun stuff and we put artist stuff like these beautiful hearts that i love on the online store you've put, you've added stuff to the sale table for people who are in kansas city and who like to shop sale tables the sale table has more stuff on it it does it does. I mean, this has been it really does. busy. We've been busy really today. Um, and little, you know, little bunny cottontail over there, little Easter stuff is just flying out of here. It's now, exciting. when we talk about uh, porch and deck, uh, deck decor. Wait a minute. Prep, Hold on. <sighs> Casey, here we go. Okay. I'm Where's good. the heart? Well, you have the papers in there. That's part of the problem, isn't it? Where's the heart? No! Okay. <laughs> Maybe we should give away like that. That'd be kind of fun. We can number the cup. Casey <laughs> couldn't <laughs> find it. I have a better idea, by the way. I really do. Um, don't forget our outdoor sculpture. We have a lot of those. Um, we have a lot of indoor outdoor products of all kinds. Pillows, rugs, poofs, so ottomans, in other words. Um, that kind of thing. Also, don't forget that do we have coasters. Do you want to do a little walk around? You can do a walk around. I didn't want to rush. Um, oh, first, let's go over here to cut it real quick. But can you go over here? Take him to see all Sorry. your beautiful things. Really quickly, I want to show you guys this really quickly. All three, all three of these rows are indoor-outdoor rugs. All three. And... All of the samples on this rack are indoor outdoor samples. Okay. Um, so they're just an indoor outdoor alone. You have all of this to, to consider. Okay. Um, so it's not a small selection. And on future shows, we will start featuring like cotton, wool, different ones, indoor outdoor pillow, indoor outdoor pillow. This is a linen. It's indoor only. Indoor outdoor pillow, indoor outdoor pillow. I have to tie my shoes on. You're in charge. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Come in, sweetie. Okay. Excuse me while I tie my shoe. As we continue to talk about the fabulousness, these are indoor, indoor, indoor. Okay. These are all linen, all by the same fabulous artist. This is the sale table, which actually has an indoor outdoor pillow on it. Fifty percent off. What? Tell me. I know. Come uh, on. Melanie. Melamine for spring and Easter, but there's some everyday on here also, some florals and things like that. All for the porch and the deck. All fabulous. 
Outdoor sculpture galore. The grill, the grill guy. guy. The sports guys. The monsters. The football guys. The number one football teams. All that kind of stuff. If you look here, this is kind of a fun area. Gearing up for spring. Take a few more ganders here. And over here, we've got a spring guy. This is an indoor-outdoor uh, PET rug, just so you guys know, the wolf healing one. Look how it looks like look. he's on a lily pad on a lake. This is our lily pad guy. Let me get him where he can move. Isn't he fun? He's way cool. He moves and shakes. He'll move in the wind. He's our froggy there. guy. This is actually um, a cotton tote. So great for getting outside and going from place to place. So if you're heading over to someone else's house and you need to take your kit. We have uh, placemats, um, some we've, designs we've had before, and some new designs coming in. Totally washable, great for your great for out, Yes, great for outdoor dining. We use these on our, our picnic table in our backyard. They're washable, totally washable. Washable, very, very light. light. If you look over here, Dakota, table runners and some of our placemats that we currently have, and we have more, like I said, lots more coming in. But some really great colors to start. Our cups in other colors. Um, and then some of our melamine that we keep around all the time. We have more coming in there too. Oh, I want to show you guys one more thing that I think is Better a really, take them. really oh, nifty item. We've talked about this before, but I want to remind you. This is our ultrasonic di oil diffuser. So it, it, we use our fragrance oils in it. So any of our candle scents that we have, we also, well, we're sold out of some of them right now, but we usually have them in the fragrance oils. So it's a great way to layer your candles, but candles blow out when you're outside, right? But you want to have them. Um, and you want the scent of them, especially that. These little diffusers are fantastic because you can set them in the corner of the patio or the deck or the porch, plug them in where you plug in your party lights. Um, and you could have a wonderful scent um, going on. Or if you're taking your nap, you could use relaxation and relax out there. It's a fantastic way to scent an area. They look just like this. They're the cutest little macaron. And the oil goes in here with some water. Okay, you plug it in. So easy, it has a fill line. Yeah, it has a fill line. You turn it on. And then this is a light ring that glows. And it changes color, or you can set it on any color you want. So it makes fun. And you just turn it on, and it... it has your diffusing oils here. Um, it's does wet. It's ultrasonic, so it's just the it's just, it's just the, like mist. the mist. We um, have a customer who is doing this with citronella oil. Um, he's loving it. He's putting it in his backyard. So he's, you fill it to the water line, and he's dropping in his citronella oil. He believes it will keep the mosquitoes and stuff at bay. Um, now our lavender lemon lemongrass now. But yes, and our lavender lemongrass, if you don't like citronella or it's too strong for you, lavender lemongrass is a natural bug repellent. So you could also use our, our lavender lemongrass in that also for that. But this is a great way to add another layer of, um, of entertainment and design is the, is the, scent, the, the sense of smell. So this is a wonderful way to, you know how, okay, this is what I equate it to. You know how when you're out on a walk and the wind blows and you smell honeysuckle? When the wind blows, the cradle uh, will that, rock. That goes in there. Um, and you smell like a scent blowing of like honeysuckle or lilac does that. Oh, yeah. But it doesn't stay. Like it, do, it doesn't stay. So I think it would be wonderful to have it there and just have this wonderful scent going on. The rosemary mint would be beautiful outside. The lavender, of course, would be fantastic. There's a lot of scents that would be really nice. But I think it would add a lot, especially if you have a covered porch or a three season porch, a screen porch. Mm -hmm. These are wonderful ways to add um, another element. It also kind of takes away any of that. So these guys, this guy's on our online store. Yeah, online store. Online store. And the oils, as we get more, will go onto the online store. Uh, like I said, we sold a bunch, so we have, we're have restocking. I believe relaxation, lavender, lemongrass, rosemary mint is in stock right now. And then we have others on the way. Mm -hmm. So. We had some on the some of the scents that were being phased out. We had on the scent of, but I think they're all sold. But I think it's very important to know that this device complies with Part 18 of the FCC rules. Part 18. I can't go into the details because I'm not. We a were legal concerned about that, and now we're not. But Part 18, part 18 is 18 covered. Covered. Done. We got it done. In the done. bag, people. In the bag, people. Um, okay. Questions? Final comments? Anything you guys sort of feel like you need to know? 
anything that's itching at you and you need answers to, what can we do to be helpful to you? Well, we need to say hi to John, Shelly, Debbie, and Jessica. Hi. Hi. Hi, friends. Hello, all you fabulous people. Joining us on the Hump Join Day us. Happy Hour. Hump Day Happy Hour. Um, Live thank you. and in person. In person. The Stuff Sisters. Yeah. Here in the Midwest. The heartland, the heart of the heartland, the heart inside the heart, coming from the heart. Keep going. Go Come on. on. It's like a country song all of a sudden. Keep going. She can't. She doesn't really have a country or soul. I just thought I would take a, a deep cleansing drink. A refresher. Mm. I've talked a lot. Yeah, you have. Well, you like these drugs. I like these drugs. I have a little bit of mine. Is that your second or your first? My second. Oh, good. God. So I thought, wow, I really drank well. Yeah. So, I think we're done. You guys have any questions? Oh, Anything? wait. Good questions? Oh, comments? please pull one more set of the outdoor melamine cups. <laughs> done. Blue. Um, done. <laughs> Don was adding to it with our rainbow hearts. Coming to you from our rainbow hearts. Exactly. That would be better. There are red hearts, however. I could oh, pull those out. And the new, oh, online, on the online store today, new beach hearts, all kinds of new beach hearts. Yeah, Same restock. Artist. Restock on those. There's lots going on. Bunch of new jewelry in the online store. If you go to the yeah. jewelry collections. Okay, real quick, since you guys are like VIP status, hump day happy hour heroes, know everything about our store, and you're really good at spreading the word. When you go to our collection pages on our online store, let me just demonstrate real quick. Oh, boy. Sorry. I just realized I have all the tools I need right here to demonstrate. Let me move these pillows. Red or blue? Yes. Okay, so when you go here, sorry, let me just do this. And you go shop online, and it says view by collection. Do you have that, D? View by collection. You click there, and these are the collection icons, right? Mm -hmm. When you go to a collection, let's select jewelry. Did I pass it? No, here it is. Jewelry. Okay, just so you know, the newest, we have it sorted, pre-sorted for newest to oldest. There's nothing old in our store because we sell everything pretty quickly. But the newest items will always be at the top of the collection pages. Now, there's those Chiefs what hearts. will fool you, the new Chiefs hearts that came in near the Super Bowl time, the rainbow hearts are right there. This one we showed you last week. We've got a bunch of new earrings. We showed you some of these. Um... Now, if it's a restock, it'll go back where that original one. So, like the beach hearts, you're like, you just said you had new beach hearts, right? So, those aren't here because that's actually a restock of something we already had in the store. So, you can search for them or you can just start paging through here. There's a lot of jewelry. There's like more than 10 pages. So, um, you can start paging through like this, right? Beautiful, beautiful, okay. lovely. We do go through and try to take out the sold outs when we can. However, we will leave it on here. If it's something we know we can, we think we can get again, we will sometimes leave it on there knowing we have one coming to us. So if you see a sold out and you really want it, you're welcome to reach out to us about it. Just send us a copy of the link and say this is what I'm interested in, okay? So on our main page, right here, it's shot by collection if you just page down. It's right there. Mm -hmm. Makes Lots sense. of great new stuff in the sculpture area and the fine art. Like at the very top here, Casey's got those birds on a branch. Those, we've got four or five new sets new of ones, birds. Yeah, so uh, I think it's in ceramic and pottery too. By there they are. By another local artist, those birds on a branch are back. Yeah. They're all new. I can't say back because they're all new. Newer. So beautiful. Newer. Um, new. Yep. So you get it. You guys are smart. You know what you're doing. But just to let you know, kind of, if you're looking for like what's brand new, what just got added, if you kind of look at the top of all products or top of the different pages, that's about where they will be, with some exceptions, of course, always. Because why would it be any easier than that? Um, and I did, we did launch our March featured items like we did for February. Mm -hmm. And our March hours are the same as last month, but they're on here if you need them. Mm -hmm. And there's the March featured project, products right there. If you go here, it's kind of all the Easter and spring specific collections okay. right there for you what else do you guys need anything else so we started these hump day happy hours to stay in touch with everybody and we hope that's what we're doing is staying in touch with you if you're unable to visit our store because you're not traveling or you're uncomfortable going out shopping please know we have an online store for you if you're comfortable coming shopping please come there's lots of new stuff all over the store we do have a big sale table as we call it the big table sale table in action 
So mostly I want to take a moment to tell everybody that we know that everybody who comes to watch our show on Wednesday nights, all of us have something going on. Probably something bigger than the hour that you give us here. So we just want you all to know that we think about you constantly. If we know what you're going through, we probably don't stop thinking about you because we know you guys have cared deeply for us in this last year with all the things that we've had going on. But we just want everybody get your phone out and hit the love emoji because we all love each other because honestly, these Humpty Happy Hours have nothing to do with what we sell every day, but they have everything to do with the people who come to us, who are our friends, who are our neighbors, who come to see us on Happy Hour because you are our friends. If you give us an hour, every week for our shenanigans, and they are ridiculous, um, I want to say thank you. So this has yes. always been about people, not the product. We've said it over and over. It's all over our website. But thank you for joining us. And I'm going to hit my little hearts right yeah, now. Yeah, I did mine. And so it's on to yours. I have my checklist for next week giveaway. That's all I have to remember for next week's show. We love you guys. We love you. And I just want to say, in under that theme, I want to say that I have, I have said <laughs> since the beginning of COVID, when people asked us about, you know, what do you think it's going to do to small business? How do you think it's going to happen? What is going to I have said for a very long time that the first quarter of 2021 is going to be the biggest hump to get over. Um, and that's when you're going to see the most loss of small businesses. And we are starting to see that. On our block alone, there's two businesses that are now gone. Avenue Bistro is leaving us. The Dime Store is leaving for a number of reasons. But a lot of that's also COVID. Uh, we just read in the newspaper that Paper Source is filing uh, bankruptcy uh, protection and closing a bunch of their stores. You know, they're a, they're a, they're a bigger, smaller well, we know type business. Well, the people that owned it, it and, and started it and everything. Um, we are seeing, um, there was another place, um, mm -hmm. Avenue, uh, Alamo Draft House downtown is closing due to COVID. Um, they're starting to drop. So um, thank you all for thinking of us shopping local everywhere yes, you can. Eat yes, local, we shop feel local. very, very blessed that we are in the game and holding our own and everything. And we want to thank you, thank you, because it's because of people like you and all the customers who can't join us on these nights that have been there for us and continue to be there for us. But also, uh, we always want to remind you, if there's places that you are really, that are really important to you, now's the time to check on them. Now's the time to buy a cup of coffee, a greeting card, whatever you can. I said this past Saturday, there was a lot of people out in Kansas City walking their dogs, spending time outside, getting outside and breathing that beautiful air and seeing that sunshine. I said, I hope everyone spends $5 today somewhere in Kansas City. Um, in the small businesses. And I, I think if we keep doing that, it will be wonderful. But that's why we're so grateful. Another reason we're so grateful. So thank you for making sure we're still here. Keep your masks on, people. It's not over. Let me you. demonstrate some. Thank you all so much. I'm gonna for demo. Here. She's gonna put on her mask, but keep your masks on. This is a that's proper it. mask. Over your nose, below your chin, side to side, snug. Snug as a bug in a rug. We'll see you guys next week. We love you, we love Bye. you.